Hello and welcome to HD Calcs. I'm Rick and in this video we're going to have a look at how we can use roots or radicals on the Casio FX 9750 G3 calculator. To do this we'll use the menu key that looks like this located here, the exe or execute key that looks like this located here, the shift key that looks like this located here, the x squared with the shift function of square root key that looks like this located here, the left bracket key with the shift function of cube root that looks like this located here, and the up arrow or caret key with the shift function of x root that looks like this located here. Normally with this calculator, when we turn it on, we'll be on the main menu screen. But if we're not there, and say we're on the stat screen, we can get to the main menu by pressing the menu key here. From here, we want to use the run mode to find our roots. So we scroll over to that and press the exe or execute key. Okay, now let's say we wanted to find the square root of 25. To do that, first we press shift and then the x squared key with the shift function of square root, and we get the square root symbol with a box underneath. Now we can enter the 25 in that box and press exe, and we get our result, which is 5. Square root of 25 is 5. What about a cube root? Let's say we want to find the cube root of 1000. To do this, we press the shift key and then the left bracket key with the shift function of cube root. There we go. We see a three in the root position there. And then we enter 1000 in the box and press exe and we get 10. So the cube root of 1000 is equal to 10. What about a root that isn't a square root or a cube root? For example, the fourth root of 16. To find that, we press the shift key and then the up arrow or caret key. There we go, we now have two boxes to fill in. In the first box, we enter our four because we want to find the fourth root. So we go four and then scroll over. And in the second box, we enter 16 because that's what we're finding the fourth root of. And press exe. And we get a result of 2. So the fourth root of 16 is 2. All right. I hope this helps, and good luck on those tests out there, everybody.